Okay, right now we're in a level area um, behind the two little ponds, and it's it's really level, so we're thinking we could have the ceremony here, maybe? And then um, there's one pond, there's the other one. We could have like a little tiny bridge or something so people can walk easily to the other side of it. Um, and then over there you can see the pavilion and the actual winery building, and there's a little patio on the back of it. I'll zoom in so you can see that. Um, and we could have the cupcakes and um, different things there. Then people could go inside. There's going to be a wine tasting going on during the, um, I mean, not a public one, obviously, but one for the, for the wedding. Um, and then an open bar inside, so we could put a sign there telling them that, and then have the picnic right out there. I mean, really, we could spread it out across that whole field. Mm -hmm. And then have dancing in the pavilion later on, and we could decorate all of it. And since it's so much less expensive than everywhere else, we'll have to check and see how much the catering is. But mm -hmm. um, since it's so much less expensive than everything else, we could afford to splurge on the decorations and do a lot with that. It's actually the same price as Allerton. Same price as Allerton. Or cheaper. And that's necessary because... Sure. <laughs> um... Because Allerton is twelve hundred for six hours. Of course, this is unlimited time. Yeah, like this is fifteen hundred for unlimited time. That's true. I don't know how much and, the catering is. And it, we don't have to get kicked out till midnight. Exactly. Exactly. Which is My good. Thought. Yes. Because we don't want all of you fine people to have to leave before you've gotten the chance to have a good time. Here's something else. This 